A young man that they say could not be nothing, couldn't do nothing. Amazing, amazing what my God can do. It's amazing, amazing what my God can do. It's amazing, amazing what my God can do. We need to understand that we are a part of something bigger than who we are. It's amazing what God should be one foundation. Welcome to a life-changing experience with Evangelist Jerry Thompson. Evangelist Jerry Thompson has a sincere compassion and love for winning souls. The need to go back and reach others has become a passion for Jerry Thompson. He illustrates his gratefulness towards God through the gift of writing and singing that the Lord has blessed him with. May you enjoy the music ministry of Evangelist Jerry Thompson. Welcome to Vision of Truth Outreach Ministry. This is your truly Reverend Jerry Thompson. I want to thank you for tuning in to this ministry from day to day, week to week. I want you all to remember that Vision of Truth Outreach Ministry is a ministry where nobody becomes a somebody there's somebody in you there's somebody in me you know today i want to speak about forgiveness forgiveness is so important because a lot of us go through our whole lives holding up grudges holding up hatred towards one another we often wonder why is it that we can't be blessed like the other guy I want to say to you the only reason why a lot of us don't receive our blessings is because we fail to forgive and I really want to take our time I want to take my time today on speaking on forgiveness because I, I've been re receiving various requests for prayer for all kinds of prayer I'm grateful and I love it there's hundreds of them a matter of fact there was one place that there's 200 people calling in for prayer at a time and the lord spoke to me and he says son tell them about forgiveness and that's why their prayers are not being answered because they fail to forgive those who harm them those who continue to harm them. your blessing is in a, a box that says in order for you to get in you must first forgive those who have trespassed against you the bible is not a lie and I'm going to read the word and share it with you. But before I do that, I want to ask God's blessing right now. Father, in the name of Jesus, we come before your presence, Lord God. We're not of self because self cannot do any good thing. But by that power that you invest in all of us, you gave us the strength and you gave us the ability to be born. You gave us that gift of life, Lord God. And so many of us fail to appreciate it for what it is. I know in your word, Lord God, you say you are the breath of life. And every breath that we breathe as human beings, we're breathing in the presence of God. Father, I pray right now that every listener, every hearer of the word, that they may look at you and not at me, because I'm merely a vessel. And Lord God, I'm worthy only because I have faith. I'm worthy only because your word says, if I just believe and receive the word of God in me, then I am truly born again. Father, may we, may we stop and think and not look at the building to be the church, but that we are the church. We are the only true example of God's gift to man. We are the true example of your word through us to shine a light in this world of darkness, Lord God. And I pray right now that every listener, every hearer of your word, that they may realize that the word that you speak cannot be a lie or it will go void and heaven and earth will pass away because your word is true. Your word is real. Your word is life. It's a lamp unto my feet. And that light, Lord God, I follow. And I pray, Father, if there be any weakness in me, that I may leave it at the feet of the cross of Jesus and submit it to you. And Father, if there be any self, I ask that self may die, that you, Christ, may live. Bless the hearer of the word right now as you bless me. Use me as a vessel, Lord God. Cleanse me. 
and prepare me for your manservant to share the word with the whole wide world. In Jesus' name, amen. Everybody say, amen. Praise God. I'm going to be turning over to uh, St. Matthew chapter 6 and verse 14. And this is where you're going to be receiving your blessing. It's about forgiveness. It's not just praying up a storm and touching people and them falling to the ground and getting the Holy Spirit and speaking the eloquent words. Because sometimes the eloquent words do not penetrate your heart if your heart is of stone. If you've hardened your heart against your enemy and hate them, then blood cannot flow to the rest of your body where you need strength in order for you to have, to have your day-to-day -day function. So he said, for if you forgive men of their trespasses, your heavenly Father will also forgive you. I'd prefer to sit here and, and wait and let you think on that than to go any further. Think of your worst enemy, the person that has done you the worst harm. And if you fail to forgive them, you will not make it into heaven. You will not make it into the place of love, the place of goodness, the place of gentleness, meekness, temperance, the place of joy. The goodness that you feel should not be artificial. It should not be made up. And the way that you act each day should not depend on your emotions or your feelings because the minute you think about the person that you hate the most, all of a sudden your emotions change. The minute you think on the person that continues to do you harm, you get into a different mood. Don't let your salvation be that way in your life. Your salvation must be solid. It must be because you believe that God is capable and willing and able to help you through all of your problems. Did you hear what I said? You must believe that God will help you and guide you and protect you through all of your problems, not just some of them, not just the ones that you choose to believe that God will help, but those also that you are lacking faith in. Shall I go, oh Lord, where shall I go, oh, when I'm seeking, seeking a refuge for my soul, I know that we need a friend, oh, just to guide us to I said, where could I go but to the Lord? Oh, I said, where could I, could I go? Lord, where could I go? Oh, when I'm seeking, I'm seeking a refuge for my soul. Where he leads me, I will follow. Where he leads me, I will follow. Where he leads me, I will follow. I'll go with him, with him all the way as the word would say say matthew chapter 6 and it's about forgiveness and verse 14 and 15 and verse 15 says but if you forgive not men their trespasses neither will your father forgive yours it is so simple when God says, I gave my only begotten son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish, 
He meant the Jews and the Gentiles. He meant all people, all mankind. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it is so wonderful to see that we're still serving the same God of yesterday, today, and forever. Please support this ministry right now by calling this number on the screen and ordering your CD by Evangelist Jerry Thompson. Please call now and support this ministry and help us get guns on the street. That's it. Vision of Truth is graciously funded through the purchase of CDs and DVDs through those buying and selling a home or business, through individuals who require a bridge loan, or by simply booking Jerry Thompson for your next special event. Visit us at visionoftruth.com or call us at 647-692-7793. The word is for all men. And here it says, but if you forgive not men, their trespasses neither will God forgive you yours please keep that in mind I don't want to go on and drag it out because the word is simple and sometimes we get too much and we do not learn how to appreciate it why should I give you a whole lot when you cannot even handle the little that we have may God help us to appreciate the simple word and teach us how to obey it while I sing a song for you, I want you to reflect on who you need to call. Because that person is waiting on you. The Holy Spirit is showing me that. You need to call that person and say, I forgive you for what you've done to me. Because I'm not going to let you win and mess my life up twice. You might say it a different way, though. Because I don't want you to start a fight and try to call them. Forgiveness, you're supposed to be humble. You're supposed to call them and not cause to stir up anger but to show love and happiness to show that you have the victory through Jesus Christ that that person can never ever harm you again and because you've forgiven that person God has forgiven you he is Lord hallelujah every knee shall bow every tongue confess that my Jesus Christ is Lord He is Lord He is Lord He has risen from the dead and He is Lord Hallelujah Every knee shall bow, and every tongue confess that my Jesus Christ is Lord. I'm going to pray right now. Father God, in the name of Jesus, as I come before your presence, as each and every last listener out there who has a desire to do good, for everyone that possess evil, I denounce that evil right now and I come against every satanic power that is touching that listener and that viewer right now. I plead the blood of Jesus upon their lives. I pray the anointing of the Holy Spirit and that they may learn forgiveness. I pray, Lord God, that through the love that you've bestowed upon this earth to mankind, that they may realize that the full potential of that love is to surrender to Jesus is to give their complete surrender the Lord God said in his word to come just as you are right now 
whatever sins or whatever it may ail you just come and say lord jesus i'm a sinner need to be saved by grace through faith in thee i know that you saved reverend jerry thompson you took him out of crime and drugs and now he's reaching back and he is not prejudice in any way i reach the black the white the pink the yellow the blue whoever they are we are god's children the sun shines upon the good and the bad father god i pray right now that every last person that is within the proximity of my voice that they may sense your presence that they may receive the anointing of the holy spirit that is about them because lord god if it's free why can we not try it try jesus now let him be your rock say lord jesus forgive me of my sins wash me in your blood father god help me that i may forgive this person that i hate so much father help me that i may forgive my father forgive me lord god that i may forgive my mother forgive me lord god that i may forgive my cousin my brother my uncle whoever has done you wrong please call them now contact them on Facebook send it out and just send me back a word and say Reverend Thompson I did what you said and it was a blessing father bless them now because your word shall not go void I'm not a preacher man that's coming with you throwing the Bible at you looking down at you I am you my brother but with a difference I made a choice and the choice that I chose was Jesus Christ that was the only difference I chose Jesus Christ. Choose ye to whom he serve. A man cannot serve two masters. You, Lord God, are just. You alone is just. And I pray that every viewer that's out there, that they may also give you the authority to go ahead because the authority is yours. They have no place to take revenge for someone who's done them harm because vengeance belong to you but father let not our enemy triumph over us let them not laugh at us let them not have the victory and the anger that we may feel at times forgive us lord god because your word said it's okay to be angry but sin not so father even when we feel to sin we pray right now that you may take full control vision of truth is graciously funded through the purchase of cds and dvds through those buying and selling a home or business through individuals who require a bridge loan or by simply booking jerry thompson for your next special event visit us at visionoftruth.com or call us at 647-692-7793 May God bless you. And I'm expecting you to call into my number and let me know that you have received the blessing of God and that you felt the release now to go and make those calls that I've requested. And as the Holy Spirit lead me, I want to just be obedient to God. There's someone out there right now that does not know how to forgive because they felt that it's because of what someone has done them while their lives has end up in such a mess but i'm saying to you right now if you need extra help call my number 647-692-7793 and if you don't get me at that moment because i'm on air like i am right now or I'm on stage in another country or singing somewhere or so on. Please don't stop calling me. I know that help can't wait, but I have hundreds of people calling. And I'm thankful that they believe and hold on to the calling of God to say, Yes, Reverend Thompson, I believe that you are a true man of God and that you care about people. Because when my life was spared, I gave everything up to serve God. And regardless of my flaws and my problems and my ups and downs that life carries, I'm going to serve God till I die. Oh, I said, where could I go but to the Lord? Hallelujah. Listen to me now. There are times when we've got problems and there are times when we're feeling the pain. But I know, oh yes I know, King Jesus is there, oh yes he is, he is 
is my today and my tomorrow only alone can I wipe away the pain so I said when could I go but to the Lord come on people sing it with me come on now the word of God says study to show yourself approved gird the word around your neck Write it on the table of your heart that in time of trouble you may have it. Please to do so. You must know God for yourself. You can't know him through your pastor. You can't know him through your brother or your sister who is faithful to God. And if they backslide, you backslide. Don't do that. Don't do that. Your salvation is your personal relationship that you have with God. And that's how you're going to get to know him. Please, ladies and gentlemen, Learn to forgive because there's victory in forgiveness. There's freedom in forgiveness. There is love in forgiveness. Call that number 647-692-7793. And for those of you who would like to continue to support my ministry, I have learned that uh, YouTube is now paying people who have over a thousand people uh, as a friend on their site. Um, so please friend me on uh, YouTube, which is Vision of Truth uh, TV. Uh, just log on to visionoftruth.com uh, and go on to my YouTube channel and uh, become one of my subscribers. And they will start uh, paying me money once I reach over a thousand people, which is pretty awesome. I have over four million viewers through um, Facebook. There's millions. But um, Facebook is not where you get paid. Facebook is where you get exposure. And I want to thank God for the media out there because I'm still on television, but television is very costly um, in producing the program, paying for the broadcast. Here you just do raw footage and it's just blessing people. And I thank God. Facebook, thank you. Um, YouTube, I also thank you. I thank every, every media uh, that is out there. Um, I want to also thank cbn tv uh, channel 798 in canada which is the cricket channel i want to thank flow tv in jamaica god bless you guys uh, you have a heart for the people and i thank you that you respect my my ministry and that which i share with the people uh, of jamaica i'm on tv flow tv there every sunday at 2 p.m tune into those programs because you will see other testimonies of mine, ex-gunmen who turned their lives around, ex-prostitutes, ex-drug dealers, people who turned their lives around and they said, you know what, regardless whether society believes us or not, we're going to serve God. As for me and my family and my house, I'm going to serve God. Oh, I said, where could I go? Oh, Lord, where? Hallelujah. Could I go? Jesus. Oh, and I'm seeking. I'm seeking a refuge for my soul. Oh, 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 oh Lord, I know that we, oh, we, hallelujah, we need a friend just to guide us to the end. Oh, I said, where could I go but to the Lord? Listen to me now. Come on now. Listen. There are times could I go but to the Lord. Hallelujah. God loves you. God wants you. He wants to lift you up. He wants to anoint you. He wants to give you that which other people take for granted. You need to keep on keeping on. You need to hold your head up high and say, Lord, in spite of how these men and women of God are treating me, I'm going to serve you. And that's the determination that I have. There are many places that I may or may not be welcome, but I'm going to serve God. I'm going to just serve God because I know that it's only Jesus Christ that can save me and keep me, sanctifies me, fills me with the Holy Spirit fills me with the attitude of love, with thanksgiving for life itself. 
If it's even for the appreciation of God saving me from where I was to where I am now, I am forever grateful. I love God, folks, and I'm not asking whether I'm saved or not. I know I am. But you know what? Only God can be my judge. Only God, and it's only God can be your judge. All I want you all to do is just take what you do seriously. Serve him seriously, honestly. I give you my heart and my soul For I know that without you I'd never be home Savior, you conquered all the right goals And I thank you and I praise you from this humble show, Jesus, I'm yours. Call that number on that screen, 647-692-7793. That's 647-692-7793. Please give us a call. Support this ministry, not for the purpose of offering and building big churches and big buildings. No, 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 don't do that. When you donate your money or sponsor this telecast, it's costing thousands of dollars every month to pay for this airing on the TV. When you pay your money, it's to bring you messages like this. So send in your donation so we can keep this message alive. Buy the CD, buy this program, uh, upload it and get it to somebody who you know it can help and make a difference. Call online for the testimony. Just log on to visionoftruth.com for the testimony why I put the gun down. Also, there are many songs that are anointed. Every last one of my CDs are anointed. God promised me that whenever they are played, lives will be transformed. Get them. Go online to uh, visionoftruthtv.com where you can watch many programs that's Jerry Thompson TV station online. So when we're off air, you can continue. And also you can download our CDs on iTunes. Just go on to iTunes and go on to Jerry Thompson or simply uh, Jerry Thompson and uh, .com and you can get them. All right. We love you. Sometimes in life, it may seem that you are alone, but you're not alone. God is with you. Vision of Truth Outreach Ministries, where a nobody can become a somebody. Why? Because I was you, but with a difference. I got involved in drugs and crime and on my way to take a man's life. But I'm one of the stories that turned out good. And I got many stories like mine to bring to you each and every week from around the world. Remember, man's reject is God's project. And who God hires, no man fire. Amazing, amazing what my God can do. It's amazing, amazing what my God can do. It's amazing, amazing.